Hi, welcome back. Today I will discuss interesting topic related to theodolite traversing. And theodolite traversing in fear, sometime the measurement between two lines is taken in angle and sometime in bearing. You can find out the bearing from the measured angle or angle from the measured bearing. So today I will show you how to find out the bearing of a line from the included angle between two lines. Consider a line AB and BC. The four bearing of a line AB is given that is 135 degree. The angle ABC is given that is 105 degree. We need to find out the four bearing of a line BC. First of all, find out the back bearing of a line AB. The four bearing is 135 degree. How to find out its back bearing? If we proceed the line AB shown in the dotted line, then this 135 degree angle is equal to that one. Add 180 degree will give you the back bearing. So the four bearing of a line AB is equal to 135 degree. The back bearing of a line AB is equal to 135 degree plus 180 degree. By adding this, we will get 315 degree, 0 minute and 0 second. Now add the angle ABC that is 105 degree with the back bearing of a line AB. That is equal to 315 degree, 0 minute, 0 second plus 105 degree, 0 minute and 0 second. By the addition of these two angles, we will get 420 degree. 0 minute and 0 second. Now subtract the 360 from the 420 will give us the 4 bearing of a line BC that is 60 degree. We find out the bearing of the next line from the included angle. Now let's suppose we have no included angle that is 105 that was already given to us in the previous case. But we have 4 bearing of each line that is shown in the given figure. We need to find out the included angle angle ABC. Extend the line AB as shown in the dotted line. The four bearing of a line AB is equal to 135 degree. The back bearing of a line AB will be equal to 135 degree plus 180 degree that will give us 315 degree. Subtract the four bearing of a line BC from the back bearing of a line AB will give us the excluded angle that is equal to 315 degree 0 minute and 0 second minus 60 degree that will be equal to 255 degree 0 minute and 0 second. As we know that the whole circle is equal to 360 degree. Deduct the excluded angle from the whole circle that is equal to 255 degree. So 360 degree minus 255 degree is equal to 105 degree is the included angle. Thanks for watching. For more information and interesting topics related to civil engineering, subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon.